Okay, I'm starting the debate from New York. We have Ravi Batra and with me here in the studio is Shalab Shelly Kumar. Now, Shalab Shelly Kumar is a billionaire. He's chairman of ABG Advanced Technologies. And to introduce uh, Shalab Shelly Kumar, he has emerged as the single biggest Indian contributor and one of the biggest financial contributors, donors for the Donald Trump campaign. He's given about a million dollars already to the Donald Trump campaign. He's wired the money. He's constantly adding on to that, Ravi, by putting in money not just in his name. He's wiring money in his wife's name as well. He says, I'm very impressed with Donald Trump. And he's actually trying to rally political support. He says, uh, Indians in America have voted more towards the Democratic Party, which I think Ravi also backs. He says that's a problem. He says, you can't trust I'll let him say the rest. He says you can't trust Hillary Clinton, etc., etc. Uh, Shalab also taking you on the debate is uh, Ray Locker of USA Today and Tyke Berry, who's an activist with Code Pink. Gentlemen, feel free to come in. This is the Trump debate. I'm going to start by asking well, uh, uh, Shalab Shelly Kumar to explain his position on, I mean, you must have a lot of money. But have you nothing else to do with your money than to give all the money to a man accused of making the most bigoted comments, including against Muslims, who is involved in nothing but fear mongering, a man who has an absolutely categorical stand on the issue of immigration and some radical ideas to implement it, a man who is sexist, a man who is racist. Why are you rewarding a sexist, racist person who has nothing but a polarizing effect on not just America, but all of the world with your money? Why are you wasting your money? Money, Shelley, you can start the debate. Ravi, you can take it on forward. Uh, explain your position. Okay, Arnav, uh, I, I, yeah. first of all, uh, sure. uh, let me uh, tell you and the viewers, um, uh, I'm not a billionaire. Uh, so it's not a question of just wasting my money. Um, but uh, uh, India is my Janam Bhumi and uh, uh, America is my Karam Bhumi. I am a U.S. citizen. I am as concerned about uh, the United States uh, as I am uh, concerned about uh, India and of course the U.S.-India relationship. Uh, in terms of support for U.S.-India relationship, uh, there is not even a question. Uh, it's way, it's far from even debating the question of what the relationship between uh, India and the U.S. will be under Hillary uh, or under uh, Donald Trump. Uh, I, as you would know, uh, I brought in, uh, I led the delegation uh, to uh, I, end the isolation of uh, then Chief Minister Modi in March of 2013. And uh, that time, uh, President of the United States is Obama. Uh, the U.S. government was not even allowed uh, to actually visit. No, no. Gandhi explain Nagar. your position. No, no. You're, no, you're, you're explain, I'm, I'm explaining explain your the position. Most people feel he's boorish, he's rude, he's racist, and he's sexist. It's, do you? Do you know, does that totally not? Disagree. Does that not hurt you? Somewhere? Arnab. Arnab. No, no. Watch it. Ravi has. Ravi wants to come into the debate. Ravi, go on. Ravi, go on. Ravi. Yeah, go on. Yeah. Ravi. Ravi, okay. go on. Yeah. Thank you. You know, you know this, the question being posed to your viewers is a false question. The relationship between the United States and India is going to be stronger every single day to, to a level that nobody can imagine. It doesn't matter who occupies the White House and it doesn't matter who India elects as Prime Minister. I, the people, I, I the people of India and the people of the United States have the same work ethic. We, we believe in secularism. We believe that merit counts. We believe that we should enhance peace and security in the world. We all believe that terror is bad. It must be killed and its roots pulled out. So the central values of the people of India and the people of the United States are the same. Now, this question, by the way, I'm very happy that, Salab, that there is somebody supporting Trump because because we are a two-party system and our voice should be heard in both parties. Uh, but the fact remains that no matter who wins this election, White House, the State Department and Congress, and but more importantly the American people love everyday hard-working Indians. What they don't want is unfair trade. What they don't want 
the, neither a friend or an enemy to cheat us when we do business ar around the world. What they don't want is unfair level field. Okay, we don't go out. We don't go out and make war no, to no, go Rabbi. take over another no, no, Ra country. Rabbi, we Rabbi. go out and defend. Rabbi. We protect. No, yeah. Ravi, we have a large Muslim population. Tell me, uh, Shelley, uh, Indian Muslims in large numbers visit the United States. You're supporting a man who's not going to allow that. That is, by the no, way, is incorrect. No, how is it not correct? That has he, not has correct. he told you? That's yes. not possible. No, what has he told you? No, that is no, not correct. What has he told you? That is not correct. You see, no, 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 one, one second. What has he, no, no, did he or did he not say that you, there should be a ban on Muslims entering the United States? He has said that clearly. Did he tell you, it's I will make an ban. exception for no. Indian Muslims? Uh, no. Just this, a minute, in, please. In, yeah. in fact, this was in the context of Syrian refugees. No, no, no. It was on the, you see, actually, has he told you? Has he qualified that by saying? Not I will allow Indian Muslims an exception. Absolutely. That is absolutely. No, no, once, absolutely. Once, 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 Ray, Ray is taking that you on. Ray, 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 go ahead. He did not yeah. say that in the context of refugees. There is no such He said ban. that in the context of there anybody. There is no such ban. And, and, and by the yeah. way, it's essentially meaningless because it would never be instituted. He said that in the context of any Muslim from anywhere. Perfect. Then he tried to clarify it by saying, well, only in countries where there is terrorism involved, which would then... India would qualify solely based on Mumbai alone. And then you could add anything else about that. So no, it wasn't about refugees. It was about people, well, well, period, no, Muslims, no, no, see, period. Actually, we have a, we have a uh, Muslim this American, is, this is the problem in, in, with, Indian Muslim uh, American uh, reporter election. at USA Today who wrote a column about this and how this would affect his whole family. Um, no, and no, it would be education. detrimental. It's detrimental to no, the no, trade relationships in the United happen. States. No, we have, we have 180 well, million too, Muslims. No, no, my, my question is... When a and presidential I think Shelley, candidate you are, you are, says it... Are, no, no, watch uh, it, watch it. Right, right, Ty, Ty Berry is also taking you on. Ty, right. go ahead. Yeah, Ty. Well, I find fault with both candidates personally. Uh, I supported Bernie Sanders in the election. I think that you see 15 years of unending Good war in, in Afghanistan. You. you see uh, the continuing wars going on, in, and we have military personnel in Iraq. We are continuously bombing in Libya now again, once again. We destabilized South Asia. We've destabilized uh, North Africa. And uh, now we're uh, uh, sticking our, our dirty dollar f uh, fingers into Asia. And I find it very troubling that both of these candidates are not questioned on what they're going to do about the situation of the longest war in American history in Afghanistan, the fact that we've destabilized a country of Libya under Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama, I reject and what this. we're going to do yeah, about yeah, Iraq. Yeah, one, 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 these are no, very no, big second. questions. It's three versus and, one. And, it's it's and, three versus one. Shelley wants to fight you back, and I think no, no, he I should. The question this. here is simple. I, the question yeah. here is simple. Uh, Shelley, who is one of the biggest donors to the Trump campaign and has stood out, in fact, he's being reported all over the media about the kind of money that he's giving in. Some people have called the kind of money that you've uh, given and Trump. And we find that troubling, troubling, to be honest. They say, they say, they say no, that no, Shalab Shelley Kumar, we should have, the Chicago-based Indian-American industrialist, one of the biggest donors for the Trump campaign, owner of an electronics manufacturing company, and the founder of the Republican Hindu coalition, is giving a maddening amount of money to Trump. And hence, we are asking him, since he is giving a maddening amount of money to Trump, the people of India are asking you, and your panelists are asking you, you need to explain. You see, sure. there are 180 million Muslims in India. 180 million Muslims in India. How can we expect to have a close relationship if America is led by Donald Trump? Because Donald Trump wants to implement a database system tracking Muslims in the United States. He wants to track every Muslim walking, entering, give him a code and track him almost as if he was a felon. So you need to tell us, Shelley, why would you expect a person like Donald Trump to have a good relationship with India when he's basically Arnab, saying he's building an iron Arnab, curtain against 180 Arnab, in, in million Indian Muslims? Okay, Shelley, uh, please respond. Okay, uh, Arnab, if I may. Yeah, uh, please. Once, once, like once, 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 Ravi, let's give him, let's give him an opportunity to respond. Yeah. Uh, first of all, let me okay. clarify. Okay. You know, this should be really a fact-based debate. Uh, first of all, just the fact uh, where one of the participants here talked about war in Afghanistan. 
There is no question we talked about that we are wasting a lot of money and U.S. involvement in Afghanistan and uh, then Iraq was unnecessary. And Donald Trump, as a businessman at that lives. time, took Let's the position. He actually did not support the move at that time, Hillary Clinton, uh, and even George Bush, of course. They uh, went to Iraq and Donald Trump opposed it. So I just want to clarify that. No, no, no. Second from the question. Indian context, you, want, you know, every well, Indian Muslim entering the United question. States yeah, will be profiled under a Trump, no, that is, under a Trump that administration. That is not correct. That right. is one, not one, second, one, not second. one second. One second. One second. One second. Ravi, one, Ravi, one second. Yes, Shelly. No, that is not correct. What's you know, not let's, correct? Let's, what is not, not, what is there, not correct? There is no policy statement from Trump, Kim, uh, Trump campaign. Uh, that is a statement from Trump. Newt Gingrich is the most senior advisor to not only that uh, is, we were Donald on the Trump, streets he has in never made a statement no, he, like this. Gentlemen, one at a time. I know all three of you are having we a go at no Shelly. One, one at a time. And I didn't hear one yeah. thing from Donald Trump. Yeah. So, so, I, I, so the, in 2002, Shelly, 2003, I never heard anything from Donald Trump that he was going to get out in the streets and complain about the government attacking Iraq, destabilizing Afghanistan, destabilizing Pakistan. Making the whole region I, I, into I a problem, that, a problem is that has gone on for 15 years. And I'm not worried about the money so much as I am the lives that were lost. American lives, Afghani lives, Pakistani lives, Pakistani military lives, Iraqi lives. No, Tyke. Millions of people have died because of a war of choice. Tyke, Tyke can I please? Tyke, can I please? I, I read, uh, Shelley I read, is hearing you from Delhi. I, 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 what, I, I if you want to, no, no, one second. I, I understand your I position. This. If I were to ask you, Tyke, what is the one reason you would tell Shelley he should not be funding Trump? What would that be? As an Indian industrialist in America, what is the one reason you would you'd say he's making a mistake by backing Trump? Let us bring it down to the one single issue. Tyke. Well, I believe the fact that uh, Donald Trump has spoken about Muslims in the United States and outside the United States in, in pejorative ways. And the fact of the matter is, is the, the United States has created okay. this conflict in the Islamic world. And it's, and it's rebounded into India. We need to, we, we see the, the election of Prime Minister Modi is, was very troubling for the United States uh, president. Is, we see that, that there is a lot of this racism is, this is towards, uh, the, is, uh, towards people of Islamic faith. And we need to quell that. We need to bring this back down to a fact, a fact base, as you were talking about. Shelly, respond. About what Shelley. needs to happen. Shelly, respond. Shelly, respond. Uh, respond. Uh, Let's give Shelly's turn. Shelly, please. Shelly and Ravi Batra after that. Shelly, please. Yeah. Okay. The problem yeah. here is we are taking a statement out of context. I met the gentleman. I met him for 45 minutes. I had a heart-to-heart -heart talk with him. Uh, you just watch RNC. Why would Muslims be participating in his nomination process? There were Muslims in the RNC uh, uh, presidential nomination. So this entire thing, which is blown out of proportion. Now, I will say that what is blown out of proportion this that the fact that he will just ban all muslims from and that's what he said no no did he say not, that that no, is no, not this is in a different context what okay. different context because what no, you, no, can, no, Ravi, you cannot Ravi, Ravi. You, you cannot take no. one paragraph Thank you. Out of a whole speech Ty, give it a break and then Ravi, no, Ravi is countering you shelly Ravi. yeah okay uh, what what Ty is saying is not America at all. This is America bashing on foreign soil and on foreign airwaves, and I reject it completely. Everybody's entitled to an opinion. That's the First Amendment. But that does not mean that that's statecraft. The fact of the matter is, the United States has kept peace and security around the world for over 70 years with a great deal of uh, blood spent so and a lot of So you call Iraq, spent. you call Afghanistan, so you call he, what's going on in excuse Pakistan, me, you call that excuse all me, peace. Excuse in me, Yemen, excuse what's going me, on there? Excuse me, excuse me, okay. Ty, give it a break. Now, the fact is, the fact is, the United, it's because of the United States that the entire world economy has gone up. Everybody's living I'm sorry, standard you're has gone yourself. up around the world. Okay. I think you're, no, I'm not. I think you're deceiving. Okay. Yourself. You don't have to take uh, that responsibility excuse anymore. Me. Ravi, listen. Ex Ravi, excuse listen. Excuse me. Ravi, Ravi. Excuse me. Ravi, listen. Ravi, listen. Ravi, listen. Ravi, listen. Ravi, I, I know that you feel. Ravi, listen. One listen. second. One with second. Respect. One second. With respect. No, I, you with respect. With respect. 
Okay, complete the point. No, but you know, you you need to you need to understand okay. here, Ravi. The, the, first of all, Muslims, here. Muslims no, 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 are welcome second, in the United Ravi, States. Ravi, listen, Ravi, listen. Have, Don't carry the burden of, of, of the entire world anymore. No, 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 no. The world doesn't need you. One second, Ravi, listen. No, Ravi, you hold on. One second, Ravi, you hold on. You're wrong. No, 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 no. We are looking out for. No, Ravi, you hold on out there. You can't preface this by saying that we have the responsibility of the world, the global economy has gone up because of us, you are fine because of us, global security and peace I said because of us. It. I've said you, I said you we need have to. done it. I didn't say we no, have you the need responsibility. To look within. I said we no, have you done have it. A problem. Now, no, you India have a has problem. Jo India has joined no, us I have a in the Pacific and in the Indian Ocean. Most welcome. No, I'm we sorry. Need India. I'm sorry. So that's not the point. I'm sorry. We are but only you know, doing what is good from making, our strategic point of view. Opinion making. Ravi, Ravi, let's bring the subject back to the. Let's bring let's bring the subject so back. So let's the bring the subject back. Muslims yeah, so, are welcome so, in the United States. Can I we respond have to the fact that I was called Captain, an American? Ca Captain Khan, I, I did not yeah. call you an American, but if you keep going this way, you will. So, uh, you know, the point is, just because you have an opinion doesn't make you speak for America. Okay? Everybody's got an opinion. And the fact that you are I on a megaphone of Arnab no, yeah. Goswami's I times now, I do whatever he's stating that I agree with That's him. That's why I and reject it. We are all in well, agreement. Yeah, the fact okay. that Shelley is supporting Trump, I like that because we have a two-party system. We should have a robust election. We are having it. Okay, we're having it. The fact that we the American exceptionalism is only is not just because of Jefferson's declaration or our constitution although that is our framework and that is our roots but it's every Ravi. American who believes in Ravi. those two documents that's Ravi. why we're Ravi. 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 one second you know problem is problem is problem is you Americans with respect to you great great respect to you Americans should stop carrying the burden of the entire world on their shoulders we are happy enough to carry our own burden you look within you need happy to understand to have you. today. Happy to have no, no, you. Listen, no, one second, <laughs> Ravi. Now you, you give me a break for a while, please. Yeah, thank you very much. You see, Ravi, okay. the issue is this. You have a problem. And that problem is called Donald Trump. He's Islamophobic. He's racist. No, I don't think he's, he's a He's sexist. And he's determined to be your, your, your president. Now, the same Republican Party. My question to Shelley is this. The same Republican Party you are giving millions of your dollars to that backs Donald Trump for president despite his bigotry preaches to India. You say, and I quote your manifesto, for all of India's religious com communities, we urge protection against violence and discrimination. What rubbish. Uh, no, no, one second. A party who puts up a man who wants a blanket shutdown on Muslims entering the United, entering the United States wants to give lessons to a country like India, which is 1.2 billion people, which has more than 800 million Hindus, 180 million Muslims, 30 million Christians, 20 million Sikhs, 7 million Buddhists, among others. You want to give us lectures about religious tolerance. I mean, Shelley, this is hypocrisy of the extreme. Okay. You have a uh, person like Donald Trump telling us to be tolerant. Explain that, please. Okay. Erna, a man I, like I, Donald I, I Trump cannot, and a party uh, like the Republican Party that puts him up is telling India to be tolerant. Yes, Shelley, okay. defend your position. You see, Defend uh, what, your position, Shelley. What, what I would say is, yeah. you know, uh, I cannot defend what is just not true. There's a lot of stuff which is pulled out what is and pulled the out? media just pulls it out. No, no, you, okay? you want this profiling is, of Muslims. Listen, is listen, that false? Look, you want pro, Muslims no, profiling. The profiling of Muslims is not on that basis just because you are a Muslim. Okay? <laughs> what Newt Gingrich, his senior most advisor, has actually come out and said this, that we should make... Uh, preaching in the mosques, which is the biggest uh, cause of uh, terrorism in the United States itself, the thought process, that should be considered no, as no, a I felony. Want to ask you. And that's no, 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 a felony. No, 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 I, I want to ask you. you no, no, that's uh, that's no, what I'm telling no, no, you. What the you facts want, no, are. No, no, you, you, you're the one supporting Trump. I'm asking you. What gives a man who wants profiling of Muslims in his country you see, you know, the, the right, the uh, right, Arnab, the right Arnab, to I'm be sorry. giving lessons? Your question assumes who wants to profile Muslims so in the country. Donald Trump wants to. No, he Donald does not. Donald Trump to. wants to. He, he does Donald not. Donald Trump wants to. Okay. Donald Trump has Just because said so. you say so. No, I'm not saying so. Just because no, you say I'm so, it does not so. become no, like no, that. No, no, I'm not no. saying so, Shelley. <laughs> I'm not correct. saying so. Arnab, it's not Ray Locker is saying so as well. It's not. Ray, go ahead. Ray. Trump has said that publicly on television 
in newspaper articles, multiple places, multiple versions of what he wants to do with Muslims coming to the United States or Muslims already in the United States. He wants to monitor mosques. He wants to put spies in mosques. He wants to keep Muslims absolutely in the United agree. States. Absolutely. All Muslims. I you agree with me. Just I you agree with me. One second. Okay. He no, no, changes second. all Ray, the time. Ray, Ray I, one I, second. I, I now, this agree. is controversial. One second. Ray, yes. Ray, Shelley says he agrees with the idea yes. of putting spies in mosques. Absolutely. He agrees with that. I will agree with that. I, 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 why would you say that? Well, first that? of all, I will tell that's, you one, why just, I will that's not American. Just a minute. That. Just it's a against minute. the law. Je well, I will agree that's with against that. That's against U.S. Why would law? we not put spies everywhere? Because no, we no, should no, put spies One at a time, everywhere. gentlemen. One at a time. Okay, I think we should get... I think first we should let... We should let Shelley Caesar, explain on this position. Yes, Shelley, go on. Okay, let Shelley explain. We should have... What the process will be... No, no, one second. Can I ask... Answer it. No, can I, yeah, can, can I, can I, should we let Shelley come Julius this Caesar point? was scammed by explain. Brutus, his friend. R R no, May I answer the question Ravi, that, Ravi, that, Ravi, that Ravi, one of the speakers let, brought up Ravi, about the larger let, source let of Shelley terrorism explain in the United his position. States? Let, 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 Rab, let Shelley explain his position. He says he agrees with the idea of putting spies in mosques. Not in Hindu temples, not in Gurudwaras. Yeah, that's very inflammatory. But that's, inf yeah, but that's inflammatory. And, okay, and yeah, so let, let, this is not, this is yeah, not but, the way to run a country, nor to, nor to explain how our country functions. Yeah, but can you okay. no, let, let, let me let me explain to you? Go ahead. Okay? Go ahead go if ahead. I would get an opportunity, yeah, please go on. It. It. It's okay. So essentially, uh, our security agencies, NSA, uh, and our other security agencies, yes. they get the chatter. They get the chatter. They track down the chatter on the internet where the uh, terrorist activity is being planned. Right now, everybody who under, goes to a mosque is a terrorist. No, no. But everybody, when it is, let's say, our, a uh, our national security agency points to a particular mask, uh, mosque for this activity, the process will be: uh, we operate. United States operates under a very disciplined uh, third part of the government. That's your judi judiciary. So you go to a judge. You show them that this is what is going on in Do this, you know about the and FISI then court? you are allowed to monitor the mosque. No, no Ravi. That's no, what no, the no, no, that's no, what no, Newt no, Gingrich no, has proposed. No, By the way, that is not what Trump has proposed. Is, okay. But no, I would take that as Newt Gingrich not, proposal, who no, is his Ravi, most Ravi, senior Ravi, advisor. Ravi is taking you on. Ravi, respond. Yeah. Ravi. yeah. The the pa the Patriot Act. The Patriot Act. The goal is laudable and wonderful. The mechanisms need a lot of fine tuning, you know, and so to and this is not really the venue to discuss this. But the fact is, we are charged to defend the United States against enemies, foreign and domestic. And not everybody who attacks us is a foreigner. They're also domestic enemies. So our intelligence agencies do not discriminate. They just want to know. Are you a friend or a foe? If you're a foe, the hell to you, we're going to get you to hell sooner. That's all. We, we, are, we are charged with defending the public safety of these United States, period. Shelley. And it's not just the Muslims. If, if you're a good Muslim and you're a gold star family and you were born in Pakistan, welcome. If you're born in India or Indonesia or Egypt or Tunisia or Libya, welcome. That's not the problem. If you have if, bad if intentions you could profile against that, the people I, of the United I totally States, agree with Ravi. No, 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 I agree with Ravi. No, it's not a profile okay, if you issue. Could profile that. This is uh, this we is had totally Timothy McVeigh but see, in Oklahoma bombing. It's so, okay. No, no, what's, yeah, so the, okay. it's what simply about defending the United States from the enemies, Republican foreign Party, and domestic. Uh, essentially, uh, excuse me, Ravi, uh, what the Republican Party, what Newt Gingrich, what Steve Yates, what uh, the foreign policy advisor team, uh, what Indian American advisory council to Trump, uh, what we are talking about is looking at the elephant in the room which nobody wants to talk about. The elephant in the room the is that the lot of terrorist activities that in the United States, like for example, the Abu Nidal, who shot the military officer who shot so many people, where that activity was. That activity could have been stopped where our intelligence knew that he is listening to, is listening to jihad in the mosque. They knew that. But under current American law, they could not go and stop that activity. If 
Otherwise, I think you're playing to the gallery. No, if that there are... Shelly, I think you're that playing to the gallery. True. One second, one second. It's not one true. Sec- one no, second. No, Ray, Ray, no, no, Ray, no, no, Ray, Ray Locker, Ray Locker, please. Ray Locker, from Washington. Ray, go on. <laughs> yeah. It's not it's Abu not Nidal. True. It was Nidal Hassan, a major in the U.S. That's Army. That's right, Nidal. Sorry, sorry He was communicating sorry online through email with Anwar al-Awlaki, the U.S. Uh, Yemeni cleric who was in in Yemen at the time. Yes, and that was picked up. That's totally different than spying on the activities of people inside a mosque. And so what Shelley was talking about in terms of monitoring those com- those communications, that's totally legitimate. United States to a foreign country plotting possible terrorism. And that was a major intelligence failure because they did not connect the dots that they had right in front of them. That's totally different than going into a mosque and monitoring what people are saying. Nidal Hassan did not get those ideas inside a mosque. He got them from other places. And so you can't use that example to somehow excuse spying on people inside a place of worship. Because where do you now, stop? Ray, do you go into Ray, you know, Orthodox Ray, Christian I, I, churches to monitor to, Armenians Ray. who might not like Turks? Ray, I'm trying to establish here because the, the point that Shalab Shelly Kumar is trying to make, he's basically saying to the Indian government, to the Indian political parties that look here, the person who I'm funding, Donald Trump, is going to be very good for India because he's going to take on Pakistan. That is at least the dream that he's putting forward. That's the picture he's putting. Like, one, one minute, Ravi, let me, no, no, Ravi, let me complete. Now, now I, want to, I, want, I want to know uh, it's not about why Pakistan. he thinks so. <laughs> Well, you know, not, no, what's it, what's it, Ravi, you buy that line? Ravi, you buy that line that Trump will take on Pakistan, will be more, you know, strategically Absolutely closer not. to India? I do not. I do not. Yeah, why I don't do you? Not. Why don't I you? Do and not. then you can, Shelley can respond. Yeah. Very, okay. very well, sim- very well, simply. No, what's it, Ravi goes first. Very simply, because, because very simply, if we, can, if we can figure out as a matter of statecraft how to get the Pakistani military to be involved in the peacemaking process and profit from the peace, we will have peace. Okay, you, the the problem is no, civilian you need to government withdraw troops from has Afghanistan. A devil of a time has a devil of a time. Excuse me, has a devil of a time trying to enhance peace with India, and it's a simple fact. So when Modi went and held his hand with Nawaz Sharif, that spoke volumes. So the political leadership wants to go in enhancing peace. But to enhance security, you got to get the military involved. And the military in, in Pakistan has a long history of itself defending the sovereignty of Pakistan because the civilian governments were not able to. So that is the facts on the ground. As far as the United States is concerned, we don't want Pakistan and India fighting. We want them to be friends. My personal desire is what? to see a European Union type of setup in in SARC. No, countries. no, one, that's never going to happen. Okay. One second, Ravi. So, Shelly, Shelly, Shelly is responding to you, Ravi. Whether it Ravi, happens, Ravi, 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 Ravi. The only thing I respond to Ravi is Ravi. In most respects, what you are talking about is almost all respects what we are talking about. I'm, I'm glad I'm talking to you. I don't know you personally there, but I agree with you. Uh, mostly, what we are talking we'll, about, we'll is, I agree that. with you. From my standpoint. Uh, from our standpoint, from Trump's standpoint, if India and Pakistan were to live very peacefully, okay, like neighbors, and not have the violence coming out of As uh, Pakistan, and by the way, I, I will uh, also tell you that, you will be surprised to hear that statement, I think probably uh, in the last 10 years or so, Pakistan has made progress. No, but Nawaz when, Sharif, when, you've, when you've spoken, Nawaz Sharif no, is yes, and yes. actually has made progress no, towards no, watch that. It. When you spoke to Trump, uh, did you ever discuss Pakistan? Did the conversation ever come up in your interactions, etc.? What yes. convinces? What did he yes. say? Did you yes. ever tell us about that? that yeah, no, what's it? Yeah, gentlemen, what's it? Let's hear. Let's years. hear from. What did he tell you about? Well, it's, it's, what did he tell you of India and Pakistan? The okay. context of Pakistan. What did he tell you? Okay. First of all, uh, with respect to India, uh, he said his uh, remarks were: India has not been an aggressor any time. Yeah. It has. It's a very peaceful nation. Yeah. Uh, the current uh, prime minister is uh, for development. Uh, which the whole world wants, irrespective of race, religion, color, whatever. 
So that is, he's very happy to hear that. Uh, he's got actually investments in India. He has visited India. So no, he what about knows, Pakistan? What did he, he tell you? The, are you? Are you just, is this is, just your expectation? Is, uh, he has is this your expectation that he'll take on Pakistan? Did he say about, something concrete? No, I'm, I'm talking about concrete as to what the you know, uh, conversation uh, with yeah. uh, Donald Trump was. Okay, I'm talking about India. And, and he uh, did point out problems with Pakistan and that is all known problems so it's not that uh, you know there is anything specific I don't want to really reveal what is all uh, in the uh, uh, in sort of what did it suggest shadow, this shadow no, cabinet. No, no, you don't have to uh, give us but, exactly what but, he look, said in but words, what is it, no, after words. Sure, for, for example look, no, he's on yeah. record saying that uh, you know the gentleman who uh, is behind bars right now Alfredi uh, who is uh, who's the one who led to Osama bin Laden? Uh, that should be uh, he doesn't quite understand why Pakistan does not free him and why doesn't why don't they decorate him? Uh, that's a statement he uh, he made. Uh, of course, uh, he, he told also, you that. Yes, he also talked about uh, the fact that uh, uh, there is a somewhat of a problem, a nuclear arsenal problem uh, with uh, Pakistan, which the for the world peace. Uh, the, he needs to see that that is it's a uh, concern, somehow managed. It's a problem. No, no, no. Is that is that okay. something which you, which you is this your expectation or concretely what he said to you? It's conversation. It's conversation. Yes. In your conversation with him, he Listen, said that you know he been he. No, no. Watch it. Watch. Are we seeking a reassurance? Are you here? Are you convinced? Because you know the problem is you're giving him a lot of money. He'll say anything that you want. You, no, you want to hear. You see, it's, it's, you know, it's, it's, it may it's, just be uh, look, pleasing look, you. Look, look, look. It's not. Uh, uh, I Donald mean, he's got Trump a lot of money. Got mixed I mean, it's been talked about Ukraine that it's a lot of money uh, that I'm giving that him a lot of money. Was taken just because, over first of all, I do want to tell ago. you as to why I decided to go at that level I did and give him that money. I think why did was you? Why did you? Why okay. did you? RHC, Republican Hindu Coalition, myself, I'm born to a freedom fighter. Uh, and like I said, India is my Janam Bhumi and uh, America is my Karam Bhumi. I'm an American citizen. I, uh, I, my is dream is to see that the United States and India in 21st century are the closest allies. And for that, uh, I will do anything. No, you're and, saying and the I only see, man, the one second. One second. Shelly, Shelly, listen. I see it Shelley, listen. clearly. Shelly, listen. This, all, see, this all me, sounds let me very finish. No. Let me finish. I see it very clearly Did that Donald under a Donald drone uh, Trump presidency, India and U.S. relationship, and by the way, this is, I can quote that as well, this is, he has said this to me directly, that that relationship will take a significant turn to the positive. Anyone say that? If, if, a, if a Mexican were to give him a lot I of money, Washington he'd say, well, I have a relationship with Mexico, we'll take a I don't no, think no, so. No, 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 no. I, he will if a Portuguese no, were to give him no, money, no, he'd no, say no, a relationship I, I, with Portugal will take I, I would, a, uh, One second, Ray. I agree. I do Ray. not agree with that. No, no, one second. Ray, Ray, do you think, do you think <laughs> Shelley is taking Donald Trump too much at face value? One second, Ray. <laughs> yes, I do. Um, I think if somebody gave me as much money as Shelley is giving Donald Trump, I would tell him anything he wanted to hear in hopes of maybe I, I could get more. I think that's politics. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Um, wait. But I, I don't question I his sincerity. I, I, I don't question Shelley's sincerity in this at all. I think what he wants is what most people in the United States want. It goes back to what Ravi said earlier. The relationship between the two countries, regardless of who is president, unless somebody you know, goes off drastically in favor of Pakistan, which is not going to happen, is only going to get better. We see that every day. We see that in popular culture as more and more Indian Americans have prominent roles in TV shows, in public. Um, they are accepted as, you know, very valued members of the United States community. As well um, as Muslim Americans. Right. And, and the economic ties only get deeper. We've seen that in the last few years with the Modi government. You know, the number of times he comes to Washington, meets with Obama, things that you see in Silicon Valley, New York, etc. I mean, the ties are there. They're enduring. They're getting stronger, particularly vis-a-vis, -vis, you know, India and China. It goes to India's advantage. So no, I but think we're seeing said you know, that, more Ray, of that. It's only going to get better. But no, can no, I listen, add something uh, to that statement? Having said that, Ray, having, having said that, Ray, Ray, having said that, it, yes. We are going to look Arna, at what's good for us. Before you move on, yeah, yeah, that's fine. I just want to say to you, I, I am tickled pink that Pandit Nehru's speech, Try Us With Destiny, on August 14, 1947, 
is reaching its full potential with Prime Minister Modi having come to the United States as often as he has. And I hope the future Prime Ministers, whenever Prime Minister Modi decides to give up his Prime Ministership, but whenever India has, whoever they pick, this is going to get stronger and stronger. The destiny of India was always to be America's best friend. A ah, special on, relationship. Such, we no, have no, with one England. second, Ravi. Ravi, listen. <laughs> Ravi, listen. Ravi, listen. <laughs> now, can I? I am tickled. The relationship I am tickled have. also. No, no, hold on. Listen. The special, yeah, I am tickled. The special listen, Ravi. Ravi, England. listen. Ravi, listen. Come we, on. We you know. deserve it with India. More. I know you are a. I know you are a very vocal New Yorker. But listen to me. Hey, also. Thank you, Ravi. Listen, <laughs> listen to me also. I am tickled pink. Tickled red, tickled crimson, in fact, <laughs> if I may say so, with what you're saying. Oh, we Americans have always wanted to be your best friends. Ravi, Americans are businessmen. I'm happy Americans to be your look best friend. American I'm happy to be your no, best friend. No, one second, Ravi. Listen, listen, listen. Yeah, you had it with the Pakistanis. You don't have a choice. You try to exit. You're That's caught in true. the bind. Not true. You not know, true. No, no, one second. Now, now let, let me tell you why it's true. Now, that let me be factual. That was a cold war. That was a cold war. Now, now well, come on. Now, let tell you one second. Listen. <laughs> I agree with that true. too. No, no, that was cold second. war. Now, listen. Four <laughs> Americans don't team up against me. The fact is, fact is here. Let's take an example. <laughs> That's about time. Let, no, no, no. We're going to keep you on this. We're going to keep you on this. Are Ravi, Ravi, listen to me. Ravi, listen to me. Ravi, come on, listen to me. Let us take an example of Hillary Clinton's foreign policy. My problem also is with people like Ray Locker and all who support uh, Hillary. You see, I'm, I'm making that assumption, by the way. I, I'm sure you, uh, you seem to support Hillary over I am a over journalist, Trump anyway. No, no, I know. But, you know, for, you, you obviously support, you, you'd say out of the two, you obviously support Hillary over, over Trump. That's quite self-evident. Now, my point is, when, when, when Hillary Clinton was Secretary of State between 2008 and 2012, she says these Pakistanis, they keep snakes in their backyard. At the same year, she went on to say, no, we must keep giving Pakistanis a lot of money. That is a double game. As a secretary of state, no, she agreed to a half in a billion state, dollar deal with Pakistan. No, so, so listen, Ravi. It's listen, not a lot of money. Using Pakistan as a security it's not a lot force of money. in their fight against Taliban. No, no, no. The United States in the needs not to a lot leave of money. Pakistan. Yeah, the other day no, but, when the but, United but, States and the but, U.S. Tai, military decided to but, not but, give but, but, Pakistan but, but, more military money, that was a good decision. No, no, one sec. Taik, ta ta if you look listen, at it, if you listen, look at it, Hillary Clinton. Keeping, I disagree with that, by the way. That's, that's a bad decision. No, no, peace what, in Pakistan is cheap. It's a bad decision. It's cheap. No, no, Taik. To give a half a billion dollars I think the problem many people in India will have with Hillary Clinton is her own checkered record vis-a-vis -vis Pakistan. Uh, and I, may I please explain this to you. Hillary Clinton in 2002, as you are aware, backed the vote to go to war in Iraq, which was a horrible decision that not just resulted in the Al-Qaeda starting a counter movement there, but something that eventually resulted in the creation and the rise of the Islamic State. So she gives a lot of money That's to Pakistan. That's true. She also backed the, 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 the dictator general Musharraf. That is true. Let's get clear on that. Yeah. Yeah, she backed Musharraf. Uh, she look, led listen, to her I'm, actions I'm led to the creation to of the Islamic in the State. Right place. No, so how do we trust her? Okay. How do we trust her over Donald Trump? Can Many I, Indians I, will can say, I, uh, add no, no, something she's to that. Sane. No, no. Uh, she is sane. Can I add something no, no. to that, Arnold? She is sane. She's mature. She's mature. Her hand on the on the ship of state rudder is steady. Ah, she Ravi, come on. That's was such taken two years nah, ago. come on, Ravi. Come yeah, on. yeah, Ravi. Okay, I wasn't I, born yesterday. Know, uh, I wasn't born yesterday. Come on. Disrupting Come on, is Ravi. fine. Destabilizer. Disrupting is Ravi. fine. But Ravi, Ravi don't no, no. get emotional about this. Disrupting is fine to get in. No, I'm not, Ravi, I'm not being emotional. <laughs> I'm Ravi, being very Ravi, calm. The thing is, disrupting is fine to get elected. It's not okay to govern. Ravi, the, Ravi, one second. Ravi, one second. It's uh, a different, that's a different issue. Different issue. No, from our perspective, we have a problem of issue. trust vis-a-vis -vis Hillary Clinton. We, well, we don't trust uh, her enough given a record. Okay. And, and well, Shelley wants to add something I understand. To that. That's Shelley. why we have Trump. That's why we have Trump. And believe me, okay. yeah, the solution but listen to Shelley. the problem. We are only concerned about what's good for us. We don't care about your Trump versus Hillary problem. We want to know what's good for us. <laughs> no, no, One second. America yeah, is Shelley good, saying so. America's okay. good for uh, India. America's good for India. Uh, Shelley, go America's Ravi, good Ravi, for India. We, it doesn't matter. Yeah. You guys raised an issue. You raised an issue.
you guys are saying that, okay, uh, Trump can say anything he wants to, to me to please me because I'm a big donor to him. Okay, first of all, I disagree with that. He will no, never because you're a nice that. guy. He will not, take, Shelley, he will nice not tell uh, uh, anybody who is, a, let's say, a Mexican-American that he will not put the wall uh, because uh, he's getting a donation from a Mexican-American. Just take it to the bank. It's not going to happen. Uh, I don't accept that. Tell you, I don't accept that. Uh, I will tell you that this, with respect to Hillary's... Uh, a future with the relationship with India as well as the relationship with um, with Pakistan. Yeah. Uh, there is a report out there which the uh, Russian uh, Secret Service or their security agency found out tracked that. Which is uh, what? Which is what? Shelley, come to the oh, point. Okay. Shelley, that come to the point. Listen. She she on the news, we don't mince our words. Okay. You might as well sure. say it as it is. Yeah. Don't she give me took, a long preface. Okay. Go on. She yeah. took. $500,000 is an FEC record from uh, some, a gentleman named Muhammad uh, uh, Tihar, uh, Tihir Javed, who is well established, proven by Jefferson County, uh, when, where he was prosecuted uh, in Come Alabama. Come to the point. Come to the point. He is an ISI Lashkar operative. Now, what are you saying? You're saying, you're saying Hillary Clinton took okay. money from a Lashkar operative? So then, he'll, then he'll be arrested, Absolutely. right? Then he'll be arrested. She got, she, What's she the got problem? Putin by Putin on the a terror watch list. She is being called by Putin because there is okay. not polit so, uh, cor uh, uh, political correctiveness in no, Russia. You are saying this so is they, could, they could say what is the truth. The truth is that is what, if you take money from terrorists, you are a terrorist. So that's what the hold conclusion on, hold on. of that, Russia that was. Kind of hold on, one sec. Ravi wants to take you on. Shelley, that Ravi kind of wants to take you on. That kind of statement works in living rooms. There he is. It, it, that kind of statement works in living rooms. It does not work in the back room of statecraft, where the job of every leader of every country well, is to protect public safety. Well, come on. And sometimes no, on. You if you are with taking the devil. money sometimes from Saudi Arabia, if Clinton Foundation no, is on. taking money hold on. from hold on. Saudi hold Arabia, on. Hold on. all hold the on. Middle Eastern countries, if you are taking money from Lush operatives, if you are taking money from ISI operatives, known people, what do you expect? I mean, it's, it's only let me natural. To you, it's, let's let me let's not to you, kid ourselves. Let me let's not hide in, uh, let me, in statecraft and this, in this over there. And that is one thing which no, is great about Donald let Trump. Me he is not a traditional politician who is going to just say he's things in, to he, make he's you in happy. He's a kindergarten of statecraft. I disagree. He's never been in one. It doesn't okay. matter. Excuse what me. what I'll tell you what exactly the same thing was being said in 1980 he has never been about da, uh, about another <laughs> one of great Americans, Ronald Reagan. Everybody called him a dumb yeah. actor. Yeah. If you remember, yeah. 1980, he was called a dumb actor. He will destroy <laughs> the world. No. Now even he had already, Democrats no, he was, he, he agree had already been governor that he of was one of the greatest presidents. Not true. It's not true. It's not true. Ronald Reagan was a did governor he not, of the great state did, of California. Did, they, did, you, did the, I, I don't want to really debate well, not here, true. Democrats go on, versus go Republicans, on, Shelley, come on. but uh, essentially uh, the, Trump, uh, the Trump liberal media, the left-wing media, they called uh, Ronald Reagan a dumb actor that he will start with his Star Wars initiative, he will destroy, he will have third world war, there will be a nuclear war, and everything will be destroyed. The whole civilization look, will be destroyed. Look, That's what they call Ronald him. Reagan, look what, what Ronald he Reagan did was one of with his firm presidents. policy but in even he seven wasn't years, perfect. What's 25 the point? million new jobs, end of recessions, and Soviet Union is gone, and one third of the humanity and, was free. And Obama has 54% approval ratings This is the thing if you want today. to get rid of Islamic extremism, terrorism, the man to get rid of that we is Muslim. Donald Trump. Then we need and Muslim that's countries what's to help happen, a repeat Muslim countries. of what happened no. in 1980. Muslim countries have it's to take the leadership. The same thing is going to happen Muslim with, countries in 2017, have to take the leadership. starting out with Donald Trump. Right. right. Wait, no, Muslim I, I leadership. I, ha Muslim countries have to take the leadership. No, no, one second. One second. Tig Tig and Ray Locker. A serious point made here. I don't know. I can't yes. vouch for the Please point that remember. has been made here by Shalab Shelly Kumar, where he says that Hillary Clinton took 
took money from a person who's linked to the ISI and the lashkar e -Toyba. That's what you said? That's correct. You, and you, said uh, where are you is, quoting this information uh, from? So this is from... Because, no, no, what's it? Where are you quoting this information from? You want to look at it? Yeah, go on, show it. What's, it, what's the source this, of information? This is, yeah. this is, this is information. Ripley's Believe It or Not. Where is this information? This is from... This is World News Politics. Russia shockingly adds Hillary Clinton to terror sponsor watch list. There is a complete article. Have you on heard it, of and this there is information? A whole list of a whole list goes on describing every point, every proof, every sentence. Everything is documented. By the in way, this, by the uh, way, Ray, if you want to no, actually no, no, Ray, look, Ray, at Ray, it, Ray, look at it, Ray, every Ray, country, listen, Ray, listen. Every Ray, country Ray, Ray has does, intelligence does services. Shelley have a point here? And ISI Ray does Shelly have a point job here. of protecting Pakistan. So be it. One sec, one sec, one sec. Ray, does Shelly have a point here? Or is this but part of the media campaign? But they should not be involved campaign? in terror. Yeah. One sec. Sh sh one sec. No, Ray. It's, it's not a legitimate point. And I'm not saying that as somebody who supports Why it's not a legitimate Clinton. point? I'm saying it as somebody If you who take money, we with, talk about... Because, because there's no... Uh, because Trump wants to... Hear yeah, him, sir. One sec. Hear him, sir. Hear Ray. No, I think you Ray, should focus on the money coming from Saudi Arabia. Much more important. I agree. Saudi Arabia agree is a I agree. is a horrible uh, monarchy Absolutely. that's oppressing after women. The, after it's the participating attack, in terrorism around the, the world. Attack. There is proof and evidence of this. And Hillary Clinton has no business taking money from Saudi Arabia when she's running 25 a quote, feminist million campaign. Dollars this Clinton is Foundation wrong. took from Saudi Arabia. Twenty-five million dollars on second. the record. Could no, check no, one, sec one, one second, after one second, one second. And this we should second. focus on. After the, the people of the United Medina States attack. need to know more after about the this. The fact that the United well, I mean, States yeah, has sold do more military equipment now. under Hillary Clinton. You're talking to India, not 60 America. $60 billion dollars worth of military equipment to Saudi Arabia now, in listen, a short period now, of time. Now listen, and, Dike, and they were Dike. used to attack Ray, the people of Ray, Yemen, the poorest country in the world. You're not talking to Americans on Dike, one minute. Dike, can I say one thing? Can I say one thing here? Well, uh, no, this is a strange second. situation. Arnab, this is a strange second. Si second. No, no, one, one second. second. Ravi, now, Ravi, listen. Now, Ravi, listen. I know you're an argumentative, vocal, very participant, enthusiastic, and no, aggressive but, lawyer from know, New York. Saudi but Arabia just second, got... Please. Saudi Arabia just had a Medina attack. Don't you think Saudi Arabia is my, now going to get on the bandwagon no, that, count, my, my, that my counter point terror one, doesn't one work minute, and they're going to wipe Ravi. it out? Ravi, Ravi, listen to me. Ravi, listen you to me. You mean in a country that oppresses its people Le daily? Can I come in, please? Again, four Americans that having a go and not freedom, letting me have a word. Really one second, wait, please. Gentlemen, please, wait. Every country, Gentlemen, please, every please give me an opportunity. An you see, the problem is, every the problem country, is here. Every country has an ecosystem. Ravi Batra. Our constitution is not the constitution of every country. Ravi Batra, we you know something, be, an important not. point has been raised here. For God's I'm sake, sorry. let me have a word in. Recent Reuters Ipsos poll puts Donald Trump today. two points ahead of Hillary Clinton as it was found that 39% of the population supported Trump while Hillary saw 37% backing. I'm quoting this from July 26, 2016. These numbers keep changing. Anyway, the point here is this. That, that, that someone explained this to me, and Ray, you explain it to me. Because you got worked up on that point. You said it was not a legitimate point. <laughs> Fact of the matter is, how can we trust? Now, I, I can ask, we can't trust Donald Trump because there are 180 million Indian Muslims, and we don't know whether he's going to let them enter the U.S. and how he's going to track them and what kind of, you know, sort of racial profiling he's going to do of those Indians. Equally, it can be said, how do we trust Hillary Clinton? She's been giving money to Pakistan. She's funded by the Saudis. And we know all that the Saudis do. They only spread, uh, uh, you know, you know, Salafi, Wahhabi, uh, uh, you know, Islam, push it into India, pump in a lot of money. They're extremely intolerant. How can a person like Hillary Clinton, if she has taken money from Saudi contacts, or for that matter, anyone who has links with the ISI or Lashkar, I don't know if this is true. This is, How can we this trust is her? Not a, this, is, this is not a litmus test. This is not a litmus Why test. Why is this for India? It's a litmus, litmus test, litmus Ravi. Test. For India, it, it is. is. No, it may not. not be for you, I, for God's sake. No, it's not. Us it is. I don't know, for once no, no, I agree no, with us you. Us it is. I agree it with you. What's it to do? Doesn't... Doesn't no, no, for India us want better relations with Pakistan? Ravi, listen, Does, better don't relations, you want better relations with Pakistan? Hello, hello, Ravi, you don't have an option. Don't you, you want you a have peaceful to have good Kashmir? Relations with us. No, no, you have to have good relations with us. You're not doing us don't a favor. Don't you want, doesn't you India want peaceful relations? You need us more than we need you. America needs India more than India Great. needs America. We'll, Let's get it we'll take you. We'll take you yeah. as a best friend. No, no, you don't need to take <laughs> us. We, we think of you. The question is this. Answer my question, Ray. If there are sources and too. contacts <laughs> if in, in Hillary Clinton's funding, which are doubtful, 
Does that not raise questions of what her approach will be if she becomes president? Ray. Four minutes on the debate. No, yeah, Ray. it does. It no. totally raises because, those questions. Because, Ravi, 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 the permanent government of the United States think, is a circuit breaker to the dating game, which is known as po the political presidential election cycle. You can't confuse government. <laughs> no, 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 with let, let, let Ray come in. Okay? Let Ray Being come in for God's sake. One not second. Dating. Ray. Dating Ray. is not marriage. Here's the deal. You look at her conduct as Secretary of State. You judge whether you think that she was leaned too, for, too far uh, on behalf of Pakistan versus India during those four years and judge for yourselves. She was, you know, when we had a major run up in Afghanistan, we needed the Pakistanis help, obviously did things to court the Pakistanis um, in conjunction with Richard Holbrook, who was doing the diplomacy in Afghanistan and Pakistan. Um, I know that Holbrook antagonized the Pakistanis and he was Clinton's person. So you have to look at that record and judge for yourselves. Did she do right by India during that time? And I think if you let look me at ask the panelists money goes another question. The Global let Foundation. Me, can I ask the panelists a question? On. Ray, you have a counter. Can okay. I just? No, no, no I'm not countering him. I, I just have a question. Do you think U.S. aid, military U.S. giving of eight nuclear capable F-16s, that is what Hillary supported. That's what Obama pushed hard to give country which is having so much huge deficit, uh, deficit that is the United States of America at this point in time, to give uh, something Pakistan. like 600, 700 million dollars worth of F-16s nuclear capable to it's Pakistan. Nothing. Do it's you nothing. believe Hold that was on, a good nothing. action or that was a bad action? And Hillary Isn't fully in support of that action. Good for India. It's, it, it's, it's, it's nothing compared to what America is, is doing with the United States. United States mm -hmm. and uh, Indian navies are t together in the, in the Indian Ocean and the Pacific Ocean. This is simply to tell Pakistan, don't worry, India isn't attacking you. Don't <laughs> worry, <laughs> relax. No. See, I, I, I don't, uh, by the nothing. way, by the way, for okay. your reviewers, uh, you should know that we, Republican Parliament, in the Republican, in the DC, were able to stop it. So F-16, you could celebrate that were not given to Pakistan. Okay, now, yes. at this stage, we were recently, the, anyway, it doesn't matter. At this stage, doesn't matter. At this stage, doesn't one last question. One last question here, Jen. You keep giving money like this to, to all politicians or it's only Trump? Uh, well, I, I will say that, I'll tell you <laughs> this is all, all record. This, this is a complete record. Uh, it's, everything is open no, in the United States. you keep giving money to Trump. Uh, no, the Trump over there, I support uh, uh, I, my party. I'm no, a Republican. I, I'm sorry. It's I'm a, a Republican. No, one second, one second. I, I yeah, the, the fact is, if, why does it... Listen, so, I sorry, like can, I, can, I, can I ask a layman Not question true. here? I like I, I, can I ask a layman? Uh, uh, can I ask a layman question? <laughs> Ravi, Ravi, last question, layman question. <laughs> if there's one person who doesn't need money, not your money, not any money, it's Trump. Why doesn't he fund himself? Why does he need anyone? This is American system. Uh, he's a very Arnab. good, he's a very there good is, business You have man. to have, it's he not that he, the, 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 <laughs> an American system in an election year, let's say 2016, is going to cost the presidential race a billion dollars. It's going to cost the other Republicans, if you combine all the Senate races and all the House races, yeah. it's going to be close to $3 billion. Yeah. Okay, you expect him to By take his entire assets and put it into this? Why not? Oh, national service. Really? <laughs> Come on. National <laughs> service. If <laughs> he I wants to serve know, the country, let him spend, yeah, let him spend for the anyway. senators and congressmen I and all viewers, that. that. Viewers, okay. viewers, this has been a fascinating <laughs> debate. Tyke Barry, Ray Locker, Ravi Batra. <laughs> and the man, and the uh, man who's continuing to pump more and more money into the Trump campaign. Let's see what happens in November. Shelley and Ravi, of course, and thanks for joining me. today, right? Oh, uh, yeah, tickled we, we got today. tickled. I got tickled with what you said as well. Ravi Batra, thank you very much. Good talking to you. Thank, thank you for you joining guys. In debate number two Thanks on the news are tonight. Thank you.